Curious George, Tadpole Trouble. George was exploring a lake with his friend Bill. George was a good explorer and always very curious. He was especially curious about tadpoles. Bill told George he could be in charge of the tadpoles they found. George took tadpole watching very seriously. He watched them swim in their glass bowl. He fed them boiled lettuce. He took them for a swim in the lake. At the time, it seemed like good exercise for tadpoles. When the tadpoles did not come back, George started to worry. What would Bill say? He had to find them. George spent hours at the lake. He found turtles and water beetles and minnows, but no tadpoles. Every time George would visit the lake, he would look for the tadpoles. Several weeks went by. Finally, he found something that looked like a tadpole, but it had legs and almost no tail. So George let it go. A few weeks after that, George took a walk in the city to think about his tadpole problem. He was going back to the lake soon. Bill would be very disappointed if George had lost the tadpoles. George walked so long, he found himself in front of the museum. He saw a butterfly that reminded him of being at the lake. He followed it. The butterfly flew into the museum and George kept following past all kinds of exhibits. There was a special display about creatures that lived around lakes. George knew about many of them, like turtles, minnows, lizards, and tadpoles. The picture of the baby tadpole reminded him of his own tadpoles. Next to it was one of the funny creatures George had seen in the lake. It had legs and a smaller tail. Now he understood. The creatures with legs were tadpoles too. His friends had not vanished. They were just changing and growing up. George was so excited, he left the museum without finishing the exhibit tour. As soon as George got back to the lake, he looked for his missing friends, especially the ones with little legs and almost no tails. But they were not there either. This time, George could find only frogs. Lots and lots of frogs. What a good idea, George, Bill said, seeing the empty jar. You decided to release the tadpoles into their natural habitat so we could watch them grow into frogs. You're not only curious, you're smart too. Let's take a picture of you and the frogs together, George. Smile! <laughs> <laughs> that was Curious George Tadpole Trouble. Thanks for watching.